What's going on? It's Ed here from Clicks Geek, and today I want to walk through a junk marketing case study of ours. Um, in this, we did uh, Google Ads for this junk removal business, and I want to walk through just some stats from our campaign. Um, ran it for about a year for them, and um, it's actually paused as of today, um, so you're not going to see the green light here, but uh, just want to walk through it real quick. So as you see, this is our campaign right here. And we were running 75 bucks a day. Um, in total, they got 1,371 clicks, 15,000 impressions. They got almost a 9% click-through rate, which is on the on the very high side. Typically, anything above 2% is, is considered good. Um, our lowest we want is at like 5%. Ideally, we want it have as high as possible. Um, their, um, their average cost per click was about 14 bucks. Um, we got them 579 leads, and um, average cost per lead was 33 bucks uh, per lead. Now, keep in mind, um, these are um, high intent searches for people looking for junk removal businesses in Google. So, this is a Southern California business. So, let's say um, uh, someone was in uh, Southern California. They type in Google uh, junk removal business in, and then insert the name of the city. Um, and our ads would appear there, our landing page, call tracking, the campaign that we've built. And, um, you know, for that kind of stuff, you're going to pay a little bit more. You're going to pay the premium because it's such high quality traffic um, and it's going to produce. Um, so almost a 50 percent, a little bit less things, about a 40 percent conversion rate um, for that um, from from click to actual cost per lead. So um, it's a little bit different strategy than going after, say, broad match traffic, which a lot of people do in this industry, and you might pay a dollar, two dollars, three dollars, four dollars per click. Problem is, you need lots of those clicks to start producing leads in any volume um, for it to make sense. So for us, we prefer to pay a little bit more, go after the better quality traffic, and get a person um, to call in right away. Um, so we're able to produce really high conversion rates in our campaigns. So. Just to give you an idea, when it comes to Google Ads, you've got three levers you can pull in order to, to, to produce a really successful geometric growth type campaign. It's, are you selecting the right keywords? Are you writing compelling enough ad copy to elicit the click? And then last, are you sending that traffic to a page that's going to convert that traffic at a high enough rate so that you have a, uh, a cost per lead that is um, viable for your business? It doesn't make sense if you're paying too much for the lead because then you're just not going to be able to back out and make money on the deal. Um, so this is the campaign in a nutshell. If you're a junk removal business and you need help with your marketing, please reach out. Um, love to have a conversation. Um, we'll know within, you know, a quick five or 10 minute conversation if there's something there, if, if uh, we might be able to help you or not. Um, but, uh, just to give you an idea, um, we work with a, a range of companies. Um, biggest one has got, you know, 10 plus locations. Smallest one is, um, a guy with a pickup truck and a trailer and, um, and, and we can kind of do everything in between. So um, our packages uh, are affordable enough so that it makes sense for kind of a wide spectrum of, of junk removal businesses. So if you're interested, um, give us a shout. Again, this is Ed here from ClicksGeek. I'll put a link uh, below to our website. You can take a look. And if it's, uh, if it's of interest, um, just uh, submit your information or uh, pick up the phone and give us a buzz and, and we'll go from there. Have a great day and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.